What's going on guys, Switchbrew here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to install Nintendo games from your PC to your Nintendo Switch console via tinfoil. So the first thing you're going to need is a modified Switch console. You're going to need a USB-C transfer cable that you can plug into your PC and into the bottom of your Nintendo Switch. You're going to need a game of choice. Here I've got Mario Kart 8. This is a backup of a game cartridge that I own, which I've dumped to the console and then put it on my desktop for the purposes of this tutorial. So the first thing we're going to want to do, guys, is head over to the Switch console. And yeah, we'll get started from there. So guys, once you're over at your Nintendo Switch console, the first thing you want to do is boot into your MU NAND or custom firmware. So I'm going to go ahead and click launch and have, head over to custom firmware. And I'm going to let this boot up. So guys, once your switch is booted, what you want to do is triple tap A so you can get to your main screen and you want to hit tin file. What you want to do then guys is let tin file fully load up and then once you've done that, what you want to do now is go ahead and plug your USB-C cable into your computer and into the bottom of your Nintendo switch. So guys, once you've plugged your USB-C cable into the bottom of your Nintendo Switch and plugged the opposite end into your computer, you should be in tinfoil like I am, as you can see. On your computer now in File Explorer, the Nintendo Switch should have popped up on your computer. So what I'm going to do is transfer it back across to my PC screen so you can see what is going on. So guys, now we're back at the PC. As I've said previously, once you've got USB-C cable plugged into the bottom of your switch and into your computer and you've loaded up tinfoil, this is what you should see on your computer screen. If you can't see this, if you go over to File Explorer and scroll down on the left hand side, hopefully switch may have popped up here. So what you want to do then is go ahead and go to the install section. You want to go into your game folder. And here is the base copy of the game. This is four gigabytes. There is an update file here and also DLC. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to drag the base game of the file across to my Nintendo Switch. And as you can see now, guys, this is copying across. So once this is complete, guys, what you want to do is go ahead and eject your USB from your uh, eject your USB from your switch and go back to the main screen. And once it's completed, it should automatically just pop up on your home screen. So once this is completed, guys, I will switch back over to the camera and show you guys what should happen. So guys, once you've uh, transferred that game across, what you want to do is go ahead and unplug your USB cable like I have, and you can just go ahead and click the home button. And once you've done that, guys, as you can see, Mario Kart 8 has appeared, so what I'm going to do is click it on it, click close to tinfoil, press on my account. And as you can see, guys, that is now completed and the game is installed. So guys, thanks for watching the video. I'll see you next time. Peace.